Today is March 18th, 2023. My name is Charles Souter. Today the topic I'm presenting is thinking ahead and anticipating problems. My main message, always try to eliminate problems before they happen. Your most important decisions are those deciding how to live the one and only life you get to live. Those big decisions often involve considerable risk and uncertainty. While you can't control and predict too far into the future, you can be relatively assured that tomorrow will be much like today, giving you a chance to plan in advance and make progress to, towards your most important lifetime aspirations. By thinking ahead, you can focus on your priorities and ensure that what matters that is most important gets done without undue risk. By anticipating problems potentially interfering with your aspirations, you can take measures early to increase your chances of avoiding them and achieving success. Proposition 1. Like I said, risks are best avoided by anticipating them in advance. The best way to avoid risk is to anticipate them before they happen. There's always something that can be done to mitigate the chance of risk. So, break complex problems or tasks into smaller, sizable actions to reduce uncertainty. Not every problem can be anticipated in advance, but many challenges can be foreseen with a little effort and foresight. Any worries you have related to a possible future problem should be considered a trigger for intervention planning. If you can do something about a future problem, it often pays to do so. Anticipating problems allows you to take evasive actions now to either avoid the problem altogether or at least minimize its impacts. The cost to prevent a problem is usually much less than the cost to fix it. There's always something that can be done to mitigate the chances of consequences and risks. Proposition 2. Disappointment is the gap between what you expect to get and what you eventually get, or reality. People often set themselves up for disappointment with outsized expectations. So don't set yourself up for disappointment by having expectations that exceed reality or your ability to achieve them. Instead of expectations, establish an intention of simply doing your best work. One of the biggest risks of making future plans or working towards a goal is the prospect of failure or ending up with a lesser desirable outcome. To work for a result and not get it is disappointing. The only re remedy to lessen the prospect of disappointment is to avoid setting unrealistic expectations and instead focus on your intentions of doing everything you can to create the inputs required of a goal. If you succeed in providing everything you can control to earn your goal, you are a success, regardless of the outcome. Whatever forces beyond your control eventually blocks further progress, then failure is not due to your lack of effort and performance. So take solace and pride from completing the inputs you did during your quest to achieve a noble goal. Proposition 3. Deliberate with caution when it comes time to act, act with decisiveness. Anticipate and plan goals with caution, seeking hidden unknown problems. Find preventable actions for all highly probable and costly problems. However, once your plan of action is in place, then proceed with all possible speed to implement it. Failure to achieve a desired goal outcome or goal can be avoided simply by not selecting risky goals in the first place. Goals with inputs that are too far outside your control should not be attempted until you can control them. If by thinking ahead you foresee too many risks that lie outside your control, you have two prudent choices. First, defer action until conditions are better suited for success. Or two, make a trial effort to get better clarity of your chances of success everything looks good, then proceed. Not every possible goal, desire, or ambition is meant to be pursued. 
you're better off seeking opportunities that are ripe for the picking. Once you're relatively assured of success in any endeavor, you should proceed as if you could not fail, using your excess confidence to steamroll over any unanticipated challenges that might crop up. Now my final message, peace of mind comes from having taken the right precautions. Thinking ahead is a valuable tool for living a successful and happy life. Not only can you increase your chances of success, but also avoid many future perils. Preparedness leads to higher confidence in success and less actual risk of running into problems. By thinking ahead and anticipating problems, you can focus your attention on a smaller set of realistic goals that are within the scope of your current abilities. That's all for now. Remember to stay positive. You'll be happier, healthier, and live longer.